we choose to bat first uh, was the par score we got uh, about what we targeted the way we started that was not the par score for sure i thought uh, we missed out staying in present especially to finish the game well with the bat bit of greed is what i felt uh, there is way to get runs in and over uh, we went for big shots and we also lost wickets i think we will explain the same thing so we definitely missed out on scoring 200 so 15 run shot uh looking at the series as a whole uh what do you think we because all the matches were closely contested we lost 3 won 2 but what do you see is the part we need to improve on skill execution under pressure that's one area i feel any phase you talk about it will come down to that individual whether with bat or ball how much he is present to that one ball battle and how clearly he can execute his skill under pressure that's where uh, i think the experience helps any team which has become a great team in t20 there are some of those great individuals who stepped up under pressure this is the opportunity for our team now because we have played so many close fought games all when they reflect and we have many more games to come hopefully they will all step up uh, we've started our preparation for june the world cup where we'll be playing netherlands so we played three matches against the team we will play will be playing in the world cup how do you see netherlands and nepal going forward our team going forward earn some respect for sure i mean i got a couple of feedbacks from their side that uh, very good tight unit you know you compete well and that was always the call from our side but having said that again i know that netherland is also a team which has beaten many big teams they have few more players who will come in their squad so we have to work for them as well uh, when it comes to world cup world cup opportunities over there expectations and the pressures are different but it's an opportunity for us to step up this time around when we go to the world cup we're going to hong kong with uh, without some important players and i think uh, it's experimentation until uh, for the with zoon squad in mind so how do you see this uh, home series coming up and especially the next one against hong kong against hong kong uh, opportunity one again to expand the bench strength but more important to see if someone can do some extraordinary performances out there if they can put up an extraordinary performance <coughs> it will again create an opportunity for that individual Uh, overall we have very clear about how the squad looks but like you said a bit of experimentation is also equally important right now because we have time but but is uh, yeah just the one of both sides went with four seamers today um the event the fact that Spain actually went better especially towards the back end of the match was that a question of misreading the pitch or just come down to execution again came down to execution i think uh, we did have two different plans one of the plan is abhinash bora for us and another plan was lalit rajbansi for us but having said that we know that what abhinash also did in last game against them and throughout the role that he plays for us so the game was well placed you know when we look at it uh, if we had executed those balls under pressure we could have still defended this total which came against nabib abhinash did very well so it came down to for us on that particular day to back a player for a particular role उच्च सोच को निर्माण सगरमाथा सीमेंट जुनी जुनी लाई